So this is my new desktop. It has an RTX 4070 Ti graphics card, an i5 13600K processor, and 32GB of DDR5 RAM, clocked at 5600MHz, plus with a 2TB of NVMe storage. Yeah, it's fast. When designing this desktop, I had two primary goals in mind, compactness and mid to high level performance. To achieve this, I chose the Cooler Master NR200P Max case, which not only features a sleek design and compact chassis, but also includes a 280mm radiator and an 850W gold certified power supply unit, making it the perfect choice for my high performance needs. Additionally, the case has excellent airflow and a magnetic side panel which can be easily taken off for maintenance. I prefer the perforated panel for airflow, although the case does come with a transparent window. The motherboard I chose is the ASUS ROGUE Strict B760i, a mini ITX motherboard with a Wi-Fi 6 antenna and a handful of common connector ports. It fits perfectly in the compact case and delivers excellent performance. Now that I just graduated college and I'm now an engineer, I wanted a PC that could hold its weight. This rig not only meets that need, but also excels at machine learning applications and gaming. In fact, compared to my MacBook Pro 16 inch, this desktop is the fastest computer I've ever used. When it comes to gaming, I've been able to achieve over 100 FPS on ultra settings at 1440p with most games that I've played. Although the RTX 4070 Ti does help with performance in most games, the one exception is Arma 3, which is heavily CPU intensive. It's really the CPU and RAM that shine. Here are some quick benchmark results for some of the games I've played. In addition to the desktop itself, I've also carefully chosen my peripherals to enhance my experience. For my mouse, I went with the MX Master 3 wireless mouse. And for my keyboard, I chose the Satachi Slim W3, which is perfect for those who prefer a smaller and less bulky mechanical keyboard. I also use a Pseudotech ST800 microphone, which delivers excellent sound quality for its price. And my headphones are Bose QC35s, which have served me well for several years. In fact, with the audio, I'm actually recording with that mic right now. Finally, my monitor is the LG 27GN850, a 27-inch 1440p monitor with a refresh rate of 144Hz. While it's not top of the line, it's still an excellent choice for those who want a high refresh rate monitor. Overall, I'm extremely pleased with this build. The peripherals that I chose just enhance my experience with the desktop, and the desktop itself is a powerhouse for performance. If you're interested in purchasing any of the items I've mentioned, please check out the affiliated links in the description below. And if you have any questions or comments about my build, feel free to drop them in the comment section below. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. See ya.